Chess friends, I will teach you my chess strategies and tactics which I used in this game. Before starting the video, I want to tell you something serious. Stockfish lovers hate Alpha Zero and Alpha Zero lovers hate Stockfish, why? I want to tell them, I am making chess videos to improve your chess skills. We play together, Alpha Zero and Stockfish, not to prove that who is better. We play to improve your chess strategy and vision. And Google DeepMind Alpha Zero is not only a chess player, but a scientist computer also. He discovered millions of DNA structure of virus which scientists could not do. He saved millions of lives. Alpha Zero is a fashion designer also, he make beautiful and loving designs every time under one day which fashion designers may take up to few weeks. So, don't hate us. Love all, trust a few. Do wrong with nobody. Let's go, I played e4. c5. Knight c3. Black have many lines, you can play d6, e6. g6. Bishop g7. Or knight c6. Alpha played knight c6. Bishop c5. Knight d4. You can play bishop c4 or a4. I played bishop c4. e6. Knight g e2. Knight takes e2. Queen takes e2. Knight f6. You might think white can play e5, but there is d5. Pawn takes, pawn takes, pawn takes, bishop takes. Queen takes pawn. You will get this position. Black can play like this, where he have open file and open diagonal for his bishops. And it's minus one condition. So, in this position I played d3. Bishop e7. Now I played e5. Because playing d5 will not damage white, targeting the bishop. I will take the knight, targeting the bishop. If you take the bishop then I will take your one more piece. So, alpha played knight g8. Bishop e3. Knight h6. I played g4. g4 move have a big strategy. In my tournament games of cccchess.com. I played g4 against dragon chess. Where I have the exact same strategy. Let me show the game first. I have white pieces against dragon's black pieces. Let me fast forward this. After some moves later. In this position, I played king to h1 first. c5. Knight f5. I move forward my knight. Bishop takes knight. e takes f5. Dragon played knight c6. He may be play d5 in the future. I played g4. My strategy is to push my pawns on king's side. Because he have no light square bishop to attack my king. Pushing the pawn doesn't mean you wins the middle game but it's a great asset to win the end game. Look my pawn structure after 30th moves. And in the end game. After some moves later. I have great pawns position. Because of I played g4 long time ago, I have advantages. Make sure your opponent doesn't have light bishop, if there is, trade it first, then play g4. And I have my own light square bishop to support these pawns. Back to the game. The exact same strategy, I will play long castle. f4. h4. Controlling king side with your pawns. Because black can't do castle long. There is some issue with pawn structure and king safety. So, alpha played a6. d4. b5. Bishop d3. c4. Bishop e4. Rook b8. h4. b4. Knight a4. Queen c7. b3. Alpha play bishop b7. Because his bishop is very passive. When you have a very passive piece or, 
if your One Piece blocks a another pest to get active and involve the game, then you should exchange your passive piece. In this case, Black can seize my light squares with his bishop to damage my pawn structure. So, I takes the bishop. Queen takes b7. Rook g1. C takes b3. A takes b3. Castle. Long castle. Alpha played queen b5, he offers queen exchange. If you in a danger then you should offer queen exchange. Your queen is a powerful piece to attack the king. Your pawns need your queen to create troubles for the black's king, right? So, in this position. I played rook d3. You might think g5 is best move. No, it's not. The knight can moves away. And your pawns will not create any attacks to black. It's black to move, alpha played king h8. He wants rook g8. Escaping from rook's firing line. King b1. Queen d5. f4. Rook g8. In this position, you have same pawns as black's fgh pawn. Rooks are styring each other. You can't rush with your pawn so quickly. If there is a bishop to target the pawn, then you can push your pawn. If the a4 knight sighting any of these squares, then you can push your pawns to start attack. But in this case, you need some more developments target black's pawns behind from your own pawns. So, I played bishop c1. I want to play rook d d1, connecting rooks to play rook d f1. Targeting black's pawn behind from my pawn. And black can't take the free pawn. Because of rook h3. Bishop back to e7. Queen h2. Rook h1. g5. Creating 10,000 meters h battery to thunderbolt the black's king. So, in this position, alpha played a5. But better move was f5. Takes, takes. Anyway, I played rook d1. Rook bd8. h5. d6. Rook gf1. d takes e5. d takes e5. Queen c6. Rook takes d8. R takes d8. f5. You can't take the pawn. Because of g takes f5. Then I will push my pawn. You can't play g takes f6, because of bishop takes knight. And the g file will be open. The king will face lot of troubles. So, alpha played bishop f8. f6. King g8. Bishop g5. Rook c8. Knight b2. g6. Rook g1. Queen d5. Bishop takes h6. Bishop takes h6. You can't play g5. Closing your own position. You will lose your advantages. In this position, you should focus on how to break the king's side structure to attack the black's king. So, I played rook d1 first. Then g5. You can't take the free pawn. Then after some moves later. I am threatening to play queen g4, targeting the bishop and the pawn. Knight d6. f7. Alpha will lose the game very badly. So, he played bishop f8. H takes g6. F takes g6. Rook d4. Queen h1 check. King a2. Queen h3. Knight c4. Queen g3. Targeting the pawn. You shouldn't play rook g4, because of queen c3, because there is no reason to put your there. The queen will get a strong position. Queen d2. A4. B takes A4. In this position, black's strategy is queen is covering the third rank, bishop covering the diagonal and the rook covering the file. In this file, 
Rook is seizing these squares. Bishop firing this line. Every dark square is a weaknesses for you. Until you make a good pawn structure. The bishop can target these pawns in the future. Alpha played queen f3. King b2. b3. c takes b3. Rook b8. Rook d3. Queen a8. King a2. Thanks for watching, subscribe for more. Bye bye take care. See you in my next video.